Ah, what's up guys? It's me. The golden Dorothosaurus. I forgot something. Yeah, whatever. So, what's up guys? It's me. The golden Dilophosaurus here. Or Dilophosaurus Vlogs. What the heck you want to call me by? I really don't care. But, I'm pretty much going to go through my Jurassic Park collection thing. Because why not? 25th anniversary. And I decide, eh, why not? I might just do a collection video. So expect to see these things and reviews, and if you see figures that are not going to be in reviews, well, I mean, if you see figures, oh my god, if you see figures that are in reviews but you didn't really see in the collection, that's pretty much how you know that, well, they're new. So yeah. But yeah, this is basically my collection. So, first off, I just want to point out. So, I just want to go through this stuff first. So, first, we pretty much got the Jurassic Park the game from Xbox 360. Don't play that anymore. No Lego Jurassic World, even though this is actually more for children, honestly. So, mm, it's a little more for children, not really older people like me. Um. At 20, speaking of 25th anniversary, I got the 25th anniversary for Michael Christian's Jurassic Park, which is the original, which is the real owner of Jurassic Park. This like happened years ago, pretty much. I got Michael Christian's um, The Lost World, the original Lost World. Um, at Jurassic Park 3, sadly, I lost the box, so basically I just put it with the Jurassic Park thing. Got the Jurassic World Junior Novelization. Honestly, didn't really... Honestly, Junior Novelization didn't really... Oh, God. It didn't really... It ain't that great. Got Jurassic World. Blu-ray, pretty much. I think it came with a lunchbox as well. I still have it. I just didn't really put it in my review. There's actually quite a few things that I didn't put in this review. I mean, not review. In this collection video, so... I don't have the whole collection because there's still stuff that's not in it. I know where it is, but I just didn't really put it in because I didn't feel like it, so. Well, I mean like, the stuff that I know, but I just didn't really like know. I mean like, I, I don't know, I just thought it wouldn't really be, I didn't really feel like it would be, um, I don't know, so, I don't know. it would just be a waste of time if that makes any sense. Uh, dress bar for Blu-ray. Pretty much. But now we went through this. I still got more stuff like video games and all. It's just I didn't really put it in here because I thought it'd be a waste of time. <sighs> okay, so on to the toys. Yep, okay, so honestly, there's just gonna be some toys that are gonna be broken, paint wear damaged, and you know, just, just not good. So, if you do not like seeing toys that are damaged, yeah, okay, um, I shouldn't have done that. If you hate seeing toys that are damaged, click away, I honestly don't care. So, go ahead, click away, but this is gonna be your only warning, if you, but yeah. Okay, so first, let's get on humans. So, yeah, pretty much. Uh, so, yeah, let's get into the human. And here's pretty much the hatchlings. So, yeah, here's the hatchlings. Now here's pretty much all of the see here's pretty much all of the baby dinosaurs pretty much. So here's all the dress park original Kenner dress park figures. So you got so here's all of them. By the way, here's some guns I don't know who belongs to, but I know they're in dress park though I think. Packy, um, some more weapons and all that. 
doing triceratops with damage. Got the bush devil tractor. Um, nothing else in the world. Only got that much, but you parasaur, conk bee. Got what this thing was called. Got the Humvee. Now in Jurassic Park, Chaos Effect. See, we got Paradynamicus. You know, and all those guys. And also, which is taking up most of the space, the mobile command center of it. So, yeah. That. Um. So, yeah, pretty much. Um. Yeah. Hmm. So you can see it's taking up a lot of space. I just wanted to do a little diagram of it. Chaos effect. After that we got Jazz Park Dinosaurs, which I don't really have that much, but very and all of these guys. We got Jurassic Park 3. And over here we got Jurassic World. Pretty much. And with that thing right there, you might be asking, where's the rest of the pieces? I have them, I know what they are, it's just I didn't really feel like getting them. And then you got Jurassic World, Fallen Kingdom. And after that, you got Jurassic World, uh, Legacy Collection. Yeah, again, I don't really have much of that yet, but yeah, I just want to show you. Besides all this, I not really can care less about this stuff. But yeah, this is pretty much clutching, really. Um, there's more to it. Hold on. By the way, if you might be curious, um, <clears throat> what these things are, it's pretty much a little figurine things that I got from Universal Studios. Yeah, you can see I don't really buy much from Universal Studios, but why? Well, Got this and blah blah blah. Then I got this and a dumb for a thing over there. So yeah, I don't know. So <clears throat> I guess this would be Jurassic Park Lost World, Chaos Effect, Jurassic World, Jurassic Park 3, Jurassic Park Dinosaurs, and Jurassic Park Universe of Studios. So so yeah, this is what these guys are from. Yeah. Okay, now on to the smaller stuff. <clears throat> Okay, so, you might be all like, oh hey, what the heck is this thing? But this is pretty much like a model of Jurassic Park. My uncle painted it. Yeah. So, yeah. The model. Sorry about that. Okay, so basically, got some mini things. Don't want to put them all in here, but I don't see these aren't that bad. So, yeah. Mm. You might be all like, oh, well, what's this thing? Well, <clears throat> the reason why I put this in the clutch in was, well, no, I got the frill, I guess. But the reason why is because it reminded me of a Dolopospinus that was not released from Chaos Effect on. I just put up a picture. So, yeah. Um. So, yeah. It's, because, you know, you got the spine, you got the Dilophosaurus look, I don't know, it just reminded me of it, so I guess that's like the closest thing you could get to Dilophosaurus. Got some Matchbox vehicles, like the Velociraptor from the old thing, now we curious what this thing is, well it's like a little bootleg looking thing, I remember years and years and years ago, I found this little bootleg Jurassic Park set, <laughs> yeah. Because, um, I remember, I was looking for the, um, the Jurassic Park 2013 or 2011, whatever the heck you want to call it. You know, the unit, the, the Toys R Us exclusives. Yeah, I was looking for some of those and I managed to find a little set that had like a little rip-off raptor pin thingy. And pretty much, yeah. But the only thing is, years later... I pretty much just ended up throwing it away, and it came with a trailer too, I threw everything away, and the only thing I, I guess, but I managed to find, 
find this though. So I'm gonna just put that over here. And it's not on scale. The wheels, the top wheels suck, but I mean the front wheels. My bad. <clears throat> and also you can see, wow, there's a lot of Legos, um, Lego dinosaur thingies. Well, there's a story behind this. You can see that. Well, two sets, and there's a lot of dinosaurs. Reason being is because what happened was, a long time ago, I pretty much had my own little Jurassic Park model thing, Lego City Jurassic Park thing, and which, or well, I tried making it look like a little Jurassic Park Lego thing, but. But in reality, it looked like darn wonder zoo for crying out loud. So yeah, but basically what happened was I bought a whole bunch of bootleg Lego dinosaur things because since these things are so darn pricey, you might be curious where all the parts are. They're all in the garage because most of this stuff is in the garage. You know, so I just tried finding what I could find. Like all this, all this is basically from the garage. So yeah, I couldn't find all the parts, but I tried. So yeah, you see like, that's you know, pretty much everything. Um, some figures too. Some of them are bootleg, some of them are not. You see up here, as well as the matchbox. If you remember my toy hunt video, my my first one. If you remember, I bought both of these, and they're still in the box because I never opened them. And I don't think I'll ever open them. I don't know why. <clears throat> yeah, I, don't know why. I just, I don't know why. I just never wanted to open them. Also, by the way, like everyone knows that, or well, at least seen my reviews, they always see this little mini gate thing. Don't remember where I got it, but I have it though. So it's meant to be over here, but these are in the way. So, but usually, yet again, you always like see them right here. So. Yeah. And also before that, if you remember, there was actually this thing. Yeah, you can tell it's like a um, Pachycephalosaurus. And um, basically the same coloration as the, as the one from the movie. Also, it's weird how it's white. I never understood that. Like, seriously. There's like little whiteness on it. I tried scrubbing it a lot, it just never comes off. So that's pretty much permanent, sadly. Yeah, some sets, you got the Jeep, you got the helicopter, you got the Jab Spear, the figures on, yeah. Well guys, thanks for watching, and see y'all next time, goodbye. And also remember to like, comment, and subscribe, and have a wonderful day, and pretty much happy collecting. See y'all next time, goodbye.